What's going on, boys and girls? All right, man. I have a, uh, I have a thing that I want to talk about. I was just accused of being a hate preacher. Okay, I preach hate. Jesus is love. Okay, and I'm a hate preacher. Now, let me admit first of all that I am not one of these preachers out here constantly preaching the love of God, the love of Jesus. That's just not my style. Okay? If you guys want to hear about the love of God, you're going to hear it from me every now and then, but not very often. But that doesn't mean I'm a hate preacher. Okay? What I do, guys, is I expose evil. Let me let let me let me uh let me explain something to all of you real quick like The way to hell is wide and it's heavily traveled. The world is going to be deceived by Satan, by evil, by false preachers, by false doctrine, by politicians, governments. Okay, they're all going to lead the masses to hell. Let me let me let me say that again. The road to hell is wide and heavily traveled. The way to heaven is narrow and only a few are going to find. So you do, do you guys understand why most people are going to hell? Because they've been deceived. Okay? They're being deceived. I'm the guy, I'm the preacher who is trying to undeceive you. I'm pointing out the government. I'm pointing out Donald Trump. I'm pointing out false preachers, false teachers, and things of that nature, trying to get you people to open your eyes to see that you're being led astray. Okay, so if that makes me a hate preacher, you know, then so be it. Then I guess I'm a hate preacher. Okay, guys? I'll leave it at that. That's the way I'm going to go with it. And so... Since I'm on this subject of hating, let's uh, let's let's bring up a couple people here real quick. Uh, Kanye West. If you go down into my library, uh, when Kanye West first opened his mouth and started preaching about Jesus, okay, millions of chan millions of millions of Christians, a lot of channels were worshiping him right off the bat. Okay, I seen all kinds of inconsistencies with this guy. He was hanging out with Donald Trump. He's hanging out with all the wrong people. He's preaching a false message. You know, it's all about music. You know, and on and on. I exposed him, but I, I was not damning the guy. What I was trying to do was educate you Christians that you cannot jump and start worshiping people just because they open their mouth and say the word of God, say the word Jesus. This is why many will be led astray. Because you're jumping on that train too quick. Okay, now, all my videos on Kanye West are down below. Uh, did you know now that he just went through a divorce and he already has a new girlfriend that he's dating and having sex with? Okay, there you go, you know. What more do you want me to say? Okay, so here's a guy who's preaching about God, that God has ordained me to be president of the United States, which was a lie. So he's a liar. Now he's a fornicator. And all you Christians that are following him and listening to his advice, you're being led astray. You're going to go to hell. You're headed to hell if you keep following these false whatever. Now, can Kanye get his act together and go to heaven? Absolutely. Okay? But my my job is to again educate you guys not to jump and start worshiping people as soon as they open their mouth and start talking about Jesus. Now, let's go to the next guy. Since I'm a hate preacher. Uh Justin Bieber, Beaver, whatever his name is, okay? He was hanging out with Carl Wentz and Hillsong. I exposed Hillsong. I exposed Carl Wentz. I exposed Justin Bieber when they first got started. Okay? Carl Wentz, dude, he was dude, he was a, definitely a false preacher. I exposed everything he was doing. Guess what? He just got kicked out of the Hillsong Church because he was having affairs. 
with women. Okay, so here he is preaching the word of God, hanging out with Justin Bieber, collecting all this money, and having affairs behind closed doors. Okay, he's out of there. Boom, he's done, he's gone. I would never listen to him again. He's a liar. He's a false preacher. But again, I was exposing him, trying to educate all the Christians that were worshiping him at the time. I was trying to show them, you know, hey guys, look at what he's doing. Look at what he's preaching. You're going down the wrong road. Well, now guess what? I, I, what I said was correct. Okay, now let's get into Justin Bieber. Carl Wentz got kicked out of Hillsong. Hillsong is another false church, believe it or not. They preach a lot of uh, once saved, always saved, and all that good stuff. Jesus is God. Uh, Justin Bieber, Bieber, whatever his name is, he's going off on his own now, starting his own, join, joining some other church, starting his own ministry. Okay, now, here's the deal with Justin Bieber. Look at his lifestyle. Look at everything. I, I pointed him out before. Again, am I telling you that this guy is going to hell? No, I am not. But what I am telling you is that he may very well be and probably is going to be a false doctrine teacher. New age, new world, order. So you got all these Christians now that are going gaga, Lady Gaga, over this guy because he is talking about Jesus. Now, will he become a good preacher? Maybe. Who knows, guys? But again, the point is, I'm telling you to keep your antennas up. Don't jump on the Justin Bieber train. Okay? You guys have got to be alert. You got to pay attention, you know, to what these people are and what they could do. Again, he's a false preacher as far as I'm concerned. Uh, he could change down the line. If he does, I'll let you know what I think. But as for now... Don't worship the guy like I'm seeing all these Christians doing. They're all going crazy for Justin Bieber because he is simply talking about Jesus, you know, getting up on stage, making money, you know, preaching Jesus, you know, let's again, he may be very well be a false preacher that is going to lead many to hell. You know, once saved, always saved. What are his doctrines? What is he preaching? You know? Let's see, you know, he's he's married to the Baldwin girl. A year from now, he gets a divorce. He'll be with other women, maybe. And again, we'll wait and see, just like Kanye West. All right, guys, so I'm done hating on everybody because I'm a hate preacher. But really what I'm doing is I'm trying to save souls because many are deceived and many will go to hell. So I'm trying to wake you up. That's exactly what I'm doing right now. If you don't see it, that's your problem. You don't like me? That's your problem. Go on down the road. I'm not here to, again, gather money, gather friends. You know, but I'm not a hate preacher, guys. I don't hate my neighbors. I'm not telling anybody to kill anybody. You know, pick up your guns and start shooting like a lot of these preachers do. Uh, things of that nature. So I'm not really... I just expose evil. That's what I do. I expose false preachers. I expose evil. I'm trying to help people to wake up. Because many, many, many will be deceived according to the Bible. So it's my job to wake you up. Anyway, all right, guys. I'm going to leave it at that. Peace out. Take care. God bless. Have a great day.